What's up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name's Kat and welcome to my channel. Uh, today, as the title says, I'm going to be doing a try on Victoria's Secret haul for you guys. Um, this is how I started my channel with Victoria's Secret haul, so it is only fitting that we have a semi-annual sale haul. So, um, I have a few random things. I have some workout stuff, beauty stuff. So, I'm going to start with the items that are not try on. We're going to go from there. Um, I got a couple of the body scrubs. Um, so, I got the bikini scrub right here. These were $5. And then I got the rise and grind scrub. Um, I obviously have yet to use these. They were both originally $18.50. Which I think is a bit much, but in the summer, I really like to have these handy for um, polishing yourself between spray tans and things like that. Um, right now, the small amount of tan that I have that you can't really see in this lighting, but you'll see in the try-on lighting, um, is natural from going to the pool and stuff. So, um, but I'm really excited to try these. In my last Victoria's Secret video, I tried the um, face masks, and they were okay. Not my favorite but I got those for free, so for free they were pretty good. Um, but I'm excited to try these next. Um, I also picked up this little tiny bralette. Um, I'm not gonna film a try-on of this just because it is literally so skimpy. I'm probably just gonna wear it like when I got out of the shower after a heavy workout. Um, how much even was this? 10 bucks, um, it's if it fits. I haven't actually tried. This is the only thing I don't think I've tried on yet, um, but it's literally just like the most lightweight material. It is a bra style. I do prefer like the racerback style, um, but I thought for the price I'd give this a shot. Some of these items are probably gonna go back. Well, the one of them is 100% going back, but uh, that is neither here nor there. So that was all that was in this tiny bag. I did go into the store and um, do an order online. So it was, $100 for free shipping, so I literally just tossed this in my cart so I could get free shipping. So it's it's gonna go back. I don't even know how much this was, like 20 bucks, somewhere in there. Um, so for my girl Laura here on YouTube that uh, loves cheetah print, this is the best time to buy it. And for the record, I probably will go back um, as they reduce the prices more and more, and I'll probably honestly go back for more beauty stuff. Um, it was kind of picked over at the location I went to, but I went to a location that's closer to my office now um, than my house. So I actually have any, I've only been to one store at this point. Um, so we shall see, but um, if the beauty stuff goes even more on sale, I'll probably go back and get some more stuff like this. It's clothing that I purchased. Um, one thing that I purchased that I'd actually been looking at on the website and wondering how it would look in person. Sorry, I'm trying to reclasp it from, I did the try on portion before, um, filming this portion so I could tell you how things fit. Um, so the first item is this little corset and it's a silky corset. I got it in a size extra large, um, delicate fabric. Please handle with care. Let's see, this was $35, I think. Okay, so this was $30, actually. Um, and I just really wanted to see what it looked like. I haven't, in all honesty, I have bought plenty of corsets here on this channel, and none of them have fit me as well as this one. Um, but I don't know what I would wear it with, or where I would wear it, or why I need it. So it's probably gonna go back, even though it fits so nicely. Um, as you guys can see in the try on portion, I really like it. Um, but I just, uh, I just don't know what I'd do with it. And the only place where it doesn't fit perfectly is actually in the boobs, which makes no sense. It's like, I know it's supposed to stand out a little bit off of you, but it's actually pretty loose. Just like right here in the cups, like the part where my actual boob fits is fine, but it's just like above here. I don't know. But the fact that it like went on me so easily was really nice. I just, I don't know about it. So the next thing is the only thing I had 100% planned on keeping from my online order, and it is another pair of the classic shorts. You guys, I wish these had pockets, but I pretty much live in these. These ones are cutoffs, 
Um, the other ones I have that I wear all the time are rolled. I'm actually wearing a pair of rolled ones from last year. Uh, these were $20, I believe. Yes, $20. Um, and I just, I love traveling in these as well. I will probably go to Florida in these pants. They are the best, just the very best. The next thing is a sports bra. Um, I literally hauled this in last week's haul, um, except this is a different color and actually a different size. This is a 36 double D, I believe. Um, and as you can see from the try on, it is a little tight in the band. Um, and my measurements are below in the description, but for some reason, the 38s are too big and the 36s are just a little too small. Um, but since my workouts that I do are primarily high intensity, um, I would rather have it be tighter than looser because, I mean, you guys, I'm going to get a black eye for my boobs if I'm not careful here. <laughs> like, it's, it's just, it is what it is. Um, these are some of my favorite sports bras right now. Um, the last one of these I bought was in a size 36 double and I wore it to the gym last night. It was fine. This is a 36 triple. It honestly fits the same to me from what I can tell. Um, this was, oh my God, what, how much was this? This was half off. So it was $25, which is what I paid for the other one. Um, essentially I had a coupon, so I think it was less than that, but um, I really like these whenever I actually am this size it will fit really well So until then um, it's just gonna be a little bit tight, but this material does stretch out a little bit as well. So I'm just gonna Keep going you guys. I'm not stopping anytime soon. So I need more than one bra to do that so um, the final thing this is actually a quite a bit shorter video than I had anticipated uh, the final thing is a pair of workout leggings. These are from the pink side. I usually only buy them from the Victoria's Secret side. I have my eye on a couple of pairs of leggings from the Victoria's Secret side um, on the website on the semi annual sale. But right now and in the store, they were only on sale for like $45. And I don't particularly want to pay more than $30 or $35. I'd really like them more in the 20s, to be totally honest. Um, but... These were 35. I had been looking at these for a while and honestly, you guys, um, I can't decide if I'm going to keep them or not. The pink ones always fit differently and I had originally thought these were going to be cropped. Um, it doesn't say that they're cropped, but when you look at them in person, like they don't, these don't look very long, but when I put them on, they go all the way to my ankles. Um, and it was kind of hard to shoot the try on because I, so I put my leg up like that so you guys can see the um the bottom and where it hits but so they're ombre and they have all these really cool cutouts on them um and the the material is really different and I really like it um the problem with them is that my thighs still touch a little bit in the middle and not like I mean like my thighs are always going to touch they're big but like inside the pants like my thigh skin is touching inside the pants and like, I can't have that because the whole point of wearing pants this long is avoid chafing on your actual legs. So I, I don't know. I like that they come up really far and the band is super tight. They fit really nicely in the waist. Um, it's just literally just right there on the thigh. I can't decide. I have another pair that you guys saw a while ago. It had that crazy tropical print. If you remember that, their ultimate pink leggings. And I don't wear them as much because my thighs touch in the middle. And I can't figure out why because they fit like pretty much everywhere else. I just can't seem to understand it. And I mean, I'm pulling them all the way up, all the way up in into the nether regions. And for some reason, I just, I don't know. They're just shaped differently than the knockout tights that I normally wear. So who knows? Let me know if you've had the same struggles with these pants. I have not decided if I will keep them or not. I'll probably put them on at least one more time before I decide because I really do like how they feel like the fabric itself um and the the laser cutting doesn't really bother me the way the mesh on some other pants I've had bothers me so we shall see
So there you guys have it. I hope you enjoyed this video. Let me know in the comments below what your favorite thing that you bought at the semi-annual sale was. Give it a thumbs up if you want more Victoria's Secret hauls. Subscribe if you haven't already and become a member of my warrior crew. If you have subscribed, hit the bell notification so you get notified when I put out new videos, which is Mondays and Fridays at noon central time. And I'll catch you in the next one. Love you, warrior crew. Bye.